got a root, um, so technically I should say a stem, okay, plus a particular personal ending. Okay, so in, with nouns, you've got a noun stem that has a case ending on it, right? That, that's either nominative or genitive or dative or accusative. Okay, but verbs have a personal ending on it because the personal ending identify whether the verb is first person, I, second person, you, or third person, which is he, she, or it, or they. Okay. And also, the personal endings tell you the number as well, whether singular or so there's going to be different personal endings that you're going to learn that will identify whether a particular verb is first person, plural, or second person, singular. Okay. And we're not going to get into that as much today, except just to give you that framework so that you can look at the present tense of Amy. Now, Amy, again, is a verb. It's a particular type of verb. It's called an equative verb. What it does is it helps, it helps you to say that something, X, is something else. Why? Okay. Jesus is Lord. You'll have a form of Amy. There. Particularly esteem, which is a third person. He is Lord. Jesus is Lord. Okay. So you've got these different forms of Amy. Amy is the lexical form of this particular verb. The lexical form is always the present tense first person singular form, which is this one right here. Amy means I am. A, second person singular, means what? You, singular, are. Okay? Third person singular means he or she or it is. Alright? Can't be they because it's not plural. It's got to be singular. Alright? First person plural is we. And it's in the present tense. It's not we were, it's we are. All right, second person, plural. How would we say that? Y'all are. Okay. Y'all are. Or you all are. Or you guys are. Okay. Or just simply you with a little parentheses in plural are. Okay. You want to identify whether a particular form of Amy is singular you, second person, or plural, you. So you either use y'all, or you, or just put a little parentheses P for plural. Uh, talk to your TAs about how they might want you to do that. Third person, plural, how would we say that? How would you translate that? They are. They are. Now if you notice, I had 